friend. I hope you're doing well. Most of my friends lately have been wondering why I have gotten so obsessed with my voice. Yeah, and I'm finding it hard to answer this question. So I decided to do a video today to just let you know why I am so much into this. Let me give you some bit of some secrets. When I was growing up, I was a very, very withdrawn boy. I never used to talk to people that much, as I would say I do lately. Especially when I was growing up in primary school and, you know, during my, my time in school, I used to be a, a reserved guy. But in high school, I got to to learn this new thing inside me that I would speak to people so well and um, I found that I would make friends actually within my first first week in my first year in high school I had a cross section of friends from the form 1 to form 4 so I really discovered that oh I could bond so well with people and I also realized that I could speak well with them and they, they felt good around me so I thought I could do something about this, so I got to public speaking. And for four years, I used to be a public speaker, especially this was done for competition's sake, especially in music festivals and drama festivals and in presentations, entertaining the school on Mondays and Fridays. So I did this for four years, and after that, I thought uh, I needed to go to college. But when I was growing up, my dad wanted me to be Content. But then I told him uh, numbers. Uh, I love numbers, but when they get mixed up with formula, then they, they confuse me. So that, please, let me go become a lawyer. So he said, uh, okay, you go, become what you want to become. But then I, I got another thing. I either become a marketer or a lawyer. So I was stuck between the two. So I tossed a coin. Heads for lawyer, tails for, for marketer. Tails came up, so today I am a marketer. It's so funny that I decided my, my life using such a crude method. But I love what I do. Then lately I have come to think, after working for over a year now, I think I need to do the things that make me happy, the things that make me smile from within. So how I decided to do this is uh, I went I, I went back in life and in my time. So I decided to look at the highest points in my life and in my past. And these points came when I stood before people, when I spoke to people, when I smiled at people. So I decided to go back there because I think I was at my highest at that point, so I need to go back there and keep going higher. Because I believe that when you do things that make you happy, you make the people around you happier. And you know, the good thing with happiness is that you give it to people and they give it back to you, you know, tenfold, it's multiplied. So I would like you to support me in doing this. Just listen to my voices, look at my videos, check them up on YouTube and on SoundCloud and on Twitter and on Facebook. And I will really appreciate your, your encouragement. As I believe by doing this, I will achieve God's plan for me by making the people happy. Because lately, I have this dream inside me to just wake up and talk to you. Just wake up in the morning and give you the best start to your day. I want to, to read the news. I want to give the latest news for you in the morning. I want to, to hit a joke at you, to, to make you smile as you, as you leave your bed or leave your home or in your car. I just have this big urge. So I'm working on it. And the first thing that I have decided to do is to work on my voice, on my diction, and work on the basics that I need to be a radio you know, broadcaster or news reader or whatever God will bring my way. But all in all, I am working towards this big dream. And my biggest hope is 
things that would give me that positive encouragement and tell me, I think here you should have done this, I think here you should have done this, so that every single day I will become better and better. Thank you so much, and may God bless you.